Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be talking to you guys about my top five powder products, so setting powders that I can't live without. I'm on a roll with these videos. I feel like once I get like a good idea in my head and just talking about products that I love, I'll make a million videos on it. So I'm sorry, I hope you guys like these. I'm having so much fun doing them because I just love sharing things that I love and I think are really worth spending your money on. So that's why I'm doing this today. But yeah, before we get into talking about what those products are, please, please give this video a thumbs up for me and make sure to subscribe if you haven't done that already. It just, it means the absolute world to me, you guys. I can't thank you enough for subscribing, just being supportive of my channel and showing your love to me. It means everything, so thank you. And I put out three videos a week, so you don't wanna miss out on three videos every week. Definitely make sure to subscribe. But if you wanna see my top five favorite powders that I can't live without, then stay tuned for the rest of the video. All right, so I'm doing this the same way that I have been doing with all my other videos. I don't have them in an exact order. I'm just gonna pick up what I see first, tell you guys what the product is, why I love it, why it's at the top of my list. So it's gonna be fun. I've tried a lot of powder products and these five are like my absolute top of the line favorite ones. So excited to share that with you. Also, mini little update on my eyebrows. As you guys can see, they're definitely lighter than they were before. So I think most of like the, sorry, this is kind of gross, but like the flaky skin like peeled off and they did say that they're gonna look like lighter and then they're gonna darken up a little bit too. So they're gonna be a little bit darker and then I already scheduled in a few weeks for like my touch up appointment and then that's gonna be it for the next one to three years. So super excited to see what they look like when they're fully healed, but I'm loving this right now. It's given me so much just shape and color and everything. Like this is what my eyebrows look like with no makeup on, so I'm in love. Anyways, back to what you're here for. The first product that I'm looking at is, you guys already know I had to include this. By the way, I have some um, pressed powders and I have some loose powders and I have drugstore and I have high end. So it's a little bit of everything, but like my absolute favorites. So the first one is the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish. This is in shade two medium. And this one goes for $45 on Sephora, Charlotte Tilbury, wherever you wanna get it. This I literally cannot and will not live without. I have talked about this so many times on my channel and I've said so many times why I'm obsessed with this, but I will shout it from the rooftops. Literally, you need this in your life. It literally makes your pores just look like they have completely disappeared. It lives up to what it says, airbrush flawless finish. It literally looks like you have a filter on your face when you wear this. I'm just, I, I love this. Honestly, I wear this every single time I'm doing my makeup to go somewhere where I want my skin to look just perfect, like a perfect canvas. That's what this does for me. It's just the best. Again, I have this in the shade two and I clearly need more. I go through these like crazy because I literally use them all the time, but I'll just show you a little, you probably can't even see this on my hand, honestly, but this is just what it looks like. But what it does when you put it on your face is unlike anything else. It's amazing. So that's my number one. Again, this isn't like a rank or anything. I'm not going in an order. I'm just grabbing what I see first. So next is from Tatcha. This is the Tatcha The Silk Powder. This stuff is so, so, so good. I did a video reviewing this product when it first came out and I've been using it nonstop ever since because this is just so, so, so amazing. And I really like to equally switch between all of these products. Like I don't, I don't, well, I guess I would say I use the Charlotte Tilbury and one that I'll talk about later in the video the most, if I had to pick one that I use the most, but all of these I use to death. Like I use them like crazy and this does not fall short of that. Everything about this is so good. Again, it's so nice for your pores. It makes your pores just like disappear. The packaging is adorable. I'm obsessed with Tatcha's purple packaging. It's just really pretty. And it's so 
like it's such a fine powder and it goes onto your face so nice and smoothly it doesn't dry your skin up or anything like that it just really makes it feel smooth and it sets your makeup in place it's just a really really good product this one is a little bit pricey as well it's about 48 dollars i'm looking at it's at sephora tatcha wherever you want to get it and it's 48 if you get like the standard size but it's it's so good honestly so worth the high price tag i'm obsessed next is from Hourglass. It is the Veil Translucent Setting Powder. Oh my god. This is one of the best powders that I've ever tried in my entire life. And I love how innovative this packaging is too. Like the little holes are in the shape of an H. I love the packaging. It's so luxurious. It's so Hourglass. And the powder itself, oh my god. It literally makes your skin look beautiful like i always feel like a victoria's secret supermodel when i wear this powder because it's not like a matte powder but it's not like shiny either i don't know how to explain it it literally feels like you're gliding like satin across your face it's just it's so soft and it has not like a glow but it's not matte it just does something for your face where it makes it look like you're just like like your skin is just perfect, pretty much. Like it just does something different for your face, honestly. Like I absolutely love using this for special occasions because I just know my skin is going to look super flawless and amazing every time I wear this. And I always get compliments when I have this on my face. Like people always tell me, oh, your skin looks so good. What's on your skin, blah, 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 blah. And so many times it's been this. So can't live without it. Next up, this is the one that I mentioned earlier that I probably use the most along with the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Charlotte's Genius Magic Powder under eye and face. This is the loose powder version of the Airbrush Flawless Finish. I have a sick obsession for this product. I literally used it today right before this video. I have it on my face right now. I use it almost every single time I do my makeup and I like to combine these two if I'm being totally honest. Like what I like to do sometimes is I'll bake my face with this. So I'll do like the baking technique everywhere where I want it. And then I'll take like a fluffy brush. I'll swirl it around in here and I'll like wipe the product off with that or I'll like tap with this after I've done that. And it literally gives my skin the most airbrushed, most flawless, most perfect poreless look ever it's insane seriously this combination of these two is unlike anything i've ever tried and i use this almost every day on its own too just because i love how thin and fine the powder is let me show you guys it's actually really similar looking to the hourglass one but i would say the hourglass one has a little bit more of a glow to it versus the charlotte tilbury one has a little bit more of like a mattifying effect to it so that's really the only difference that i see between the hourglass and the charlotte tilbury but you can't go wrong either way honestly both of them just are gonna blow your mind how great they are but the charlotte tilbury one i definitely use very often like too often and i just look like i don't have pores i just look like my face is just naturally perfect it just does wonders for me so of course i can't live without it it's everything this one also goes for 45 dollars so same price as the charlotte tilbury one did i mention the price for the hourglass it's 46 okay i don't think i mentioned that the hourglass one is 46 dollars and the charlotte tilbury one is 45 so all four of those are around the same price so i'm sorry i know they're pricey but so worth it i'm telling you they last such a long time all such amazing products and then my last product that i have is a drugstore product i wasn't gonna make all of these the super expensive ones this is the milani it's the conceal and perfect shine proof powder i have this in shade 4 natural this goes for $10.99. You could get it at Walmart, you could get it on Milani, wherever. And it's, oops, I just spilled some. It's so good. As you can see, I have used and abused this to the maximum. I need to get another one ASAP, but this stuff is so good. I feel like it does a very, very similar thing to 
the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless. I would say if I had to pick one, I would prefer the Charlotte Tilbury just because it does that extra little something for me, but this is almost just as perfect looking. Like this does wonders for my pores. This powders me down in the perfect way. It makes my makeup last such a long time. It just does so many good things for my skin that I don't see myself living without this stuff, honestly. As you can see, I love it and <laughs> I use it. So this is just a really good one. All of these blend so well with other makeup products too. Just everything about these, you guys. Like, like I said, I've tried so many powder products and these have just been the ones that have stood out the most to me and that have done the most amazing things for me. I just can't live without them. So those are my top five. I hope you guys enjoyed. I definitely did. I love talking about products that work for me and that I enjoy and that I think are actually worth spending money on. So I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> I did. Make sure to comment and let me know what else you guys want to see from me. I love your suggestions and I really, really do take them to heart. So please let me know what kind of videos you guys want from me and I will do them. So let me know. Let me know what you thought about this video, what you thought about my choices, what your favorite products are. So just keep me posted. Let me know your favorites. Give this a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel, but stay tuned and I will see you guys in the next one.